Okay, Jim Hatton, uh, getting ready to kick off spring football a little bit more than league week. Just uh, first of all, how would you assess how the off season's gone since uh, the middle of November to this point this year, uh, getting ready to start football? You know, we've got a lot of kids that are involved in track, a lot of kids that are involved in basketball, uh, and we had a good off season. Um, just look forward to getting all of our kids together. We've got our kids separated during the day in classes from. Uh, our ninth grade team, we've got our JV team in a class, and our varsity team in a seventh period class. So we're not able to put them all together. Uh, of course, in the spring, we'll just have JV kids and varsity kids working together. So we'll have everybody together this spring, and we'll get to look at the whole unit as a team. And, and, and you know, I think we had a good off season. Really look forward to, to um, having all of them together. How, how do you feel the progress has gone in the weight room as far as kids getting stronger and faster? That uh, I think. Uh, you know, you do what you can with the, with high school kids. They're they're 15 to, to 18 years old, 14 in some cases. They're going to get bigger, faster, and stronger because of the growth pattern of a young adult. You know, so you want them to you want them to get 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 bigger, faster, and stronger. And when we've done that with with uh, our kids that are not involved in other sports, so we, we feel real good about it. Um, a lot of kids change a lot over the course of the year and, and get a little taller, and that's something that I've had to get used to coming from the JUCO ranks. It's been a little while since you watch a kid that was a ninth grader who was, you know, five foot eight becomes a six foot two senior. So it's kind of uh, unique for me. Uh